Hello friends, my name is Rahul Ronyar and today we, I will uh, introduce what is R, how to ins download and install R and how to download and install R Studio. Uh, so let's start with what is R. So R is a programming language specially built for statistical computing and its graphical representation of data sets. Basically for statistics, it is previously known as S language and uh, now it is modified with be better graphical output and some better packages and now it's known as R. R can be useful for uh, data analysis, data manipulation like linear or non-linear modeling, classical statistical test, time series analysis, classification and clustering, graphical display. In addition to previous stated application, R can also useful for making applications like website applications, machine learning and mapping. R is an open source programming language and freely available to use. So you can do directly download and use this, lang this programming language. R has thousands of ready-made uh, libraries such as so you can da instantly download those, uh, import those library and uh, use it for your data analysis. So next is who uses R. R is basically used by data analysis, uh, data analyst, data scientists and students used by economists for uh, economic and financial analysis like uh, stock predictions, used by weather department for weather predictions. R is mostly used by professors, masters and PhD students for their research purposes and for data analysis. So what are the advantages of R? In R, the syntaxes are quite easy to understand and if even a non-programmer can easily adopt the R programming environment and start data analysis. R programming is a domain specific language uh, like it is basically uh, built for a statistical analysis. Data extraction, manipulation, analysis is very easy as it has large number of ready-made um, libraries are available in CRAN. So uh, the packages can be used directly without doing the details of their underlying, underlying construct, how it is made uh, in background, you don't have to understand that. If you know then, uh, then it is better. If you don't know, still you can use those libraries for your data analysis. Basic requirements. There is no prior requirement or experience uh, required to start with R. If you have uh, previous uh, experience with pro any programming language, it will give you advantage because uh, uh, in some cases you will understand that uh, the syntaxes are quite similar and the code structure also quite similar in some cases and up to certain extent. In upcoming tutorial, I will introduce everything from the beginning so that any beginner can follow the tutorials without any difficulty. So let's uh, download the R and uh, install R. So basically to download uh, R, first you have to go to uh, go to this site www.rproject.org. Now open browser and go to google.com and search in the search bar R and press enter and it will uh, give several results. Go to this rproject.org website and then go to the CRAN and there you, you will find large number of mirror links uh, of different country. Some mirror links are quite slow and some mirror links are fast like uh, I'm going for Germany which is uh, quite faster. Just click on this link. It will open uh, this page where you will find download for R for download R for Linux, download R for Mac OS and if you have Windows then you can go for this R for Windows. I'm going for this Windows. Here you will find uh, install R for the first time. Just click on that link. After that you will get download R 3.4.0 for Windows. It is applicable for both 32-bit or 64-bit. You can install in any op uh, operating system whether you have 32-bit or 64-bit. So just click on that, that link. It will pop up the download. Just you have to download and install. Next again, let's go to uh, google.com and now we will uh, download one ID that is integrated development environment. Uh, uh, the best ID for R, uh, I, uh, in my opinion, is uh, R Studio. The R Studio having uh, several good features. Like uh, if you uh, go for the conventional R uh, through terminal window, then uh, you have to give input in one window, and it will pop up the outputs in another window. So you have to uh, switch 
uh, several times such as to see your output to avoid that you can uh, use this r studio id it, it has uh, several features like you can uh, give the inputs save your inputs or you can see the output in same window also you can plot which is uh, different graphs such that uh, that also appear uh, on the same window at the uh, plotting uh, plotting sex plot section at the plot section and you can also uh, save your data and view previous uh, previously used uh, syntax and uh, data sets to download and install r studio just type r studio in the search bar and press enter after that you will get this rstudio.com link uh, or website just go to this website after that just uh, go to this r studio download section and click on the download button and it will uh, pop up this page uh, where you will find the open source license r studio desktop and some paid versions are also there commercial versions um, we are, i'm going for this uh, free version because it is free and uh, for single user just click on the download button it will uh, open this page or lead to this page where, where you will find the installers and zip files and in installer you can find uh, based on different operating system the download file or download link and for zip file in installer it will uh, install based on by fetching the data from server and in zip file you will get the whole download file and you you can also uh, use uh, install using the zip zip file and the advantage of zip file that you, you can transfer using it a pen drive or a portable uh, storage device so i'm going for its installer just click on this r studio uh, for windows as i am using the window windows uh, 10 so just click on this link it will pop up the download just you have to start download after it's downloading you just install it in your operating system after installation as I have already uh, installed in my operating system, so I'm not going for further installation. Uh, so after installation, just go to the search bar if you have Windows, or you go to the Start menu and search R Studio. It will pop up this R Studio uh, desktop application. Just click on this uh, application. It will pop up the first view. Uh, it is showing that R version 3.3.2 and uh, it is the console and the RStudio uh, uh, it is a console where you can uh, give the input and also get the output here is a environment tab here and his, uh, where you will get your uh, say different data set that you have used in analysis here is a history tab where you will get the all previously used syntaxes and codes some part or fragment of codes here is a file section where you can see all files here is a plot section all the output plots will be appear here packages all uh, all the packages for your data analysis will be available whatever the package you have installed will be available here you can search from here this search bar in help section you will get all help so uh, the major advantage of r that it has ready-made help section where you can find whatever the syntax whatever the co whatever the uh, functions and whatever the symbols you want to search you can search you will get the detailed description along with different examples so thank you for watching